Hi, um, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Bonkers McGee. Obviously, that's not my real name. Don't know why I call myself that, but that's the name I've got now, and I cannot be bothered to change it. So, hi, I'm Bonkers. <laughs> Didn't realise how that would sound. Anyway, <laughs> I am actually Bonkers, you will find this out. So, on my YouTube channel, I've decided that I'm going to pick a topic. Um, if you want to leave topics to talk about, please don't ask me to talk about politics. Because I don't have a brain, and politics, I say politics involve brains. Look at the state we're in right now! Not really. Anyway, yeah, um, if you're gonna, I say if you're gonna do it, I'm not even sure anyone's watching this. Hi, thank you if you are. Cheers. You don't have to watch anymore. I lied. Please watch some more. Don't leave me on my own. Um, basically, um, yeah, I've decided I'm gonna do a topic YouTube channel and I'm just gonna talk to you about stuff. Um, and basically, it's all gonna be stuff that I think is stupid or I feel is stupid. It's not going to be intelligent stuff. I'm basically just going to have a rant. And hopefully you find it funny or hopefully you agree with me. But basically my first topic today is I have decided are cats like peanut butter? Are the cats like peanut butter? Are cats like Marmite? Apparently I don't know my difference between Marmite and peanut butter. And you really hope I do because Marmite's not actually that nice it's one you know you love it or you hate it that's where i'm going with this so our cats do you love them or you hate them like everybody loves dogs unless you've been attacked by a dog which by the way i'm really sorry if you have but that would be, give you a reason to hate dogs but most people love dogs like the man's best friend um as you can see cat person crazy cat person that's my uh, maybe I should that uh, maybe I should have picked that as a topic. Do cats make people crazy? Yes. There we are. That's why I didn't pick that as a topic. So basically, are cats like Marmite? Like most people I talk to are like, I hate cats. They're horrible. I love cats. I think they're hilarious. Have you ever sat on the on this? Have you ever sat? On an evening, maybe a Saturday, and watched cat movie, cat movies, cat videos, cat movies, cat videos, all kind of the same thing. Maybe you don't do that on a Saturday because that's kind of sad. And you know, I'm 21, so if I'm sitting there on a Saturday, I'm not actually 21 yet, almost. Uh, if you sat there on a Saturday and you're 21 and you're not out with your friends, it says a lot about your life, doesn't it? Have I don't think I ever have done that on a Saturday. Slightly worrying. Anyway, so basically, I want to know, why do people love cats? Because I think they're incredible, but everyone I talk to is like, oh, they're so crap, they're not loyal. They're kind of not, but at the same time, like, they're fluffy. They're really cute as babies. But then you could have said that I was a cute child, and look at me now! Anyway, yeah, they're really, really cute as babies, so, like, why do people hate them? Like, okay, so you can't walk them and you can't really dress them up and, you know, they're a bit antisocial and their litter tray stinks. I, I don't feel like I'm arguing the best point of why I love cats. Maybe I should just show you my cat. Um, she's, um, basically she does this face when I do really stupid things. Like, when I used to do my podcast, she didn't like that either. And now she she's like... The look of disapproval. She just stares at me and she's like. And I can just tell. I've disapproved her. Even though I'm her owner and she's my cat. But apparently I'm being dominated by her. Because I'm a wuss. Or something along those lines. So this Chubbs the Bun. Chubbs the Bun is my boyfriend slash fiance slash person I live with. And person who basically cares for me. So in a long run, you could sort of say he's my carer. Or I care for him. We're both carers for each other. Sounds better than he's my carer. He's not actually my carer. I'm not... Sorry. I realise that could be really inappropriate. Um, moving on from that one. Um, <laughs> sorry, I am so normal. Yeah, yeah. Woo! 
Um, anyway, I'm going to show you the look of disapproval. Two seconds. There it is. See? See it? She's not impressed. I have not impressed the put off. By the way, she's not actually called the put off. I don't know why every single one of my cats ends up with a strange name. I can't tell you any other names because I can't remember off the top of my head. But she's she's called Lily. We rescued her. She was called Tilly. Tilly sounded... I don't want to offend anyone. So, with no offence, Tilly sounds a bit chavvy. Um, I feel like I'm going to upset a lot of people with my YouTube videos. I apologise in advance for being... I don't really want to swear because I really tried hard not to in my podcast. Didn't go very well, so we're gonna re we're gonna turn over a new leaf. This is like when I promise I won't break things. Never goes very well. In case you haven't. Sorry, I realise not everybody. Basically, clumsy, break things, mental one. Just some of the things people like to call me. Well, when I say some of the things, I'm pretty sure there's a big list, and it's just like annoying, crazy bitch. Um, well, yes, yeah, in my swearing thing is going so well. Um, yeah, so, why do you love cats? Are they like Marmite? You either love them or they hate them. Because, like, like I said, most people love dogs. Even if you say you don't love dogs, part of you does. Like, oh, I don't love dogs, but you go and watch 101 Dalmatians. You know what I mean? You love dogs! Shut up! But, like, nobody really talks about cats and nobody raves about them. They just post videos of them falling off, like, the ends of beds and, like, meow and so it sounds like they talk. Also, why does my cat never do anything like that? My cat doesn't jump off things and, like, fall sideways, except for my old cat. He did. It was hilarious one day. We were sitting in the front room and, no word of a lie, sat on the edge of the sofa, just out of nowhere, fell off. I cried for about an hour, not because he was hurt, because it was so funny. Um, but he wasn't technically my cat, my parents' cat, but that's a long story. Um, yeah, so basically, the cat of the Padoff, who just basically gave me looks of disapproval throughout the day, because she doesn't approve of my life. Um, yeah, um... She's lovely, really. Um, yeah, um, basically, she doesn't really do anything exciting. She eats, sleeps, and poos occasionally. Um, and then I have to clean out her litter box. And that is so fun. It's like it's like the moment if you walk a dog and your dog poos. And you're like, great, now I have to pick it up. And it's warm and disgusting. It's like cleaning a cat's litter tray out. Except I'm pretty sure now I feel I feel like picking up warm dog poo is worse. There we are, see? Totally arguing my point. Cats rule, dogs drool. I feel like somebody else has said that before. Um I'm not gonna lie, I love dogs too, but I'm gonna be a cat person. I'm gonna be one of those people that at ninety two, you come into my house and there are just cats everywhere. Um, and they're like, wow, 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 and they can all do like all the things on the YouTube videos, and I can walk them like a horde of dogs or zombies. Not really sure you walk zombies. Not really sure where this is going. Um. Anyway, yeah. Um. Cats are the coolest thing. Like most people, are like I don't really like cats. I don't understand why. They're amazing. I really do apologise, by the way, because the videos are probably going to be very much like this. Um, I'm going to come up with loads of topics and just record myself talking about them. Um, yeah, cats are amazing. They're just... Seriously, if you haven't watched cat videos, you need to go online and watch them. And then you will you have, you will have a love for cats. They're just so funny. Um, I'm the type of person that in my IT classes spent most of my time instead of learning how to use computers um how um basically looking up bald cats um and just basically crying with laughter for the whole session it would literally just be quiet and then there'd just be me in the corner giggling away at this picture of a bald cat 
I'm not really sure why I had a fascination with bull cats. They're not like, you know, you, when you think of a bull cat, you don't think, oh, they're so cute. You think, ugh. You're like a cat with no hair. That's not attractive. It's like if I went bald and lost all my beautiful natural purple locks. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you'd be like, ugh. That's not attractive. Um, because, you know, I'm so attractive already. Especially in this hat. <laughs> Woohoo! Look, I feel it's just like some weird kinky hat thing. I'm not really sure what's kinky about this. So, just uh, coming up with words and saying them now. Um, anyway, on that note, I do feel like I should leave you because I feel like I've waffled on. Again, um, please give me reasons why you dislike cats why you like cats um if anybody is actually even watching this i will actually comment back it the comments may be funny it does i'm not gonna lie to you i'm one of those people that takes a while to come up with a funny um funny pun back so uh meow <laughs>